Hello, our viewers. Welcome to our today's uh, lessons that we are going to do. Um, we are going to show you several things that you want to do in our today's uh, video. And uh, we want to show you the transition of our bath. If you check, our brooder is now empty, meaning that the bath that you were seeing here, we have moved them to another room and we have prepared this place. It is now clean, vacant, because uh, in uh, next week we'll be bringing new flock. So it has, uh, we've just moved them and we've disinfected this place. And uh, the place that we took them is this, this room. Eh? These uh, chicks are now uh, three weeks, four days. Uh, it is F1 breed that we've been talking about, the Croiler F1. So if you check the growth rate of the birds are doing very well. And uh, if you can remember, we've been visiting these farms. Uh, we've done a lot of videos in this farm. And there is another flock that we moved from this room to another room where we are now going to show you. Now, this is the new place that we brought them. This is the, the first flock that we, we've been, uh, we started with. They are now one month. Check the growth rate. Uh, we are, we've come to do the final vaccine for them. If you can check, we've separated this room just for now because we want to do the vaccination, the full typhoid. Then from there, after we are done with this, we will move them to these uh, chambers, if you can check. We'll be moving them here to pave way for the other flock, which is, will be coming here. Then uh, this will be the second month. They will be coming to this floor. Then the third month, they will be coming to the upper uh, floor. Then from there, we will be taking them out to you. We'll be bringing them to the market. So basically that is what we are going to, what is we are doing in this farm. In our today's video, we are, we've come to do the final vaccination for these birds. And uh, this vaccine, it is, uh, is called uh, for typhoid. It's the one that we've come to do. It is also um, like the one we did uh, last week, but one we did uh, uh, for pox is the video that we did, the last one. And today we've come to do the full typhoid to make sh to show our farmers and our viewers that uh, our birds are fully vaccinated. After this, we will be giving them 21 days uh, for this vaccine to now be able that uh, we, so that we, be, we can be able to take them to the market. And uh, after this vaccine, we are going to do several activities that will be showing you to make sure that what we are bringing to the market is okay. We told you that uh, any time that you do the vaccination, make sure you check the expiry date of the, the, this. And when you see, it will expire on uh, April 2022. So it means that it is the correct one. And you, when you, you, if you can see, we are doing a full typhoid vaccination. So it's the one that we are going to do. And uh, we want to show you how it is done. Number one, you prepare the way you've seen. We have separated this place to make sure the one which are not vaccinated are on that side and the one that we vaccinate are on this side. And uh, you make sure that you prepare the place. There is enough feet. And now uh, there is another guy who is preparing the water with the, uh, the vitamins. As we continue with the vaccine, you'll be seeing them taking water. And uh, we make sure that they have plenty of feet and water. It is also a, a very painful exercise for these birds. So, but it is going to be the final a vaccine. So, 
we use this syringe to pull out, pull it uh, from the this container. So the best thing with this uh, vaccine, the, there is a time that I taught you, there is a day that will be coming to this farm to know how many birds we have. So this vaccine is going to tell us how many birds that we have. And uh, if it is not going to tally with uh, what is in the record, the farm manager of this place is supposed to tell us where are those birds? Because this one is like uh, every every bird is supposed to take one ml of this. And here I have a syringe of 20, uh, 20 mils, 20 ml. So when I finish with this, I will know that I have 20 birds. So it is very clear and it is going to give us the exact number of birds that we have in this farm. So this is how you do it. You pull it out. You do it like this. It is a vaccine like just another, but this one is going to. And you make sure when you are not using it, it is in a very cold place. This is our, our ice. Ice. So if you can see, this is a, it is full syringe. So each and every bird is going to have one ml. We will be uh, giving each one ml, one ml. So if you are doing a four type, uh, four type typhoid, then you don't know how you do it and how many ml. Just from today, no, you are supposed to give one ml per bird. Then uh, you apply it where? This is where you apply, either on the, this area, where there are good muscles, here, or here. So this is what how you do it. Not on the bone, but on the, the muscles. Then you, you make sure it is one ml. You see, that is one ml. That way. Now this one is vaccinated. It is a very painful exercise for these birds. So that one is vaccinated. Uh, I have told you where there are muscles. You can uh, do it here. Uh, bring uh, nearer for the people to see. If you are not applying uh, this pad, uh, you can apply to this place this area, you see, like that. And you make sure it's one, one ml. Now we have, a, we have two. We've done two. This is the third one, meaning that we are going to get the exact number of birds that we have here in this in this farm. You don't do it on uh, any other part, so make sure you do it where there are muscles. And don't go up to the bone, just on the muscles. And as I've told you, when you check the one that we've done, they are not active because of this vaccine. Make sure it's one ml. 
When I told you about the 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 the, the breed that we have, this is this is a uh, a bird of one month, meaning that in the next two months we are going to have a very big. But this is almost a kilo. In fact, is when you weigh this one is going to be above one kilo. So by the end of three months, we are going to have a very good weight of this bird. Why? Because of the good breed that we have, and uh, the something that I told you called the uh, poultry microbes that we give our birds. Our bat, we give them poultry microbes to make sure that uh, the feeds that they take are fully consumed. When you check our floor, it doesn't have uh, a lot of waste, meaning that they are not giving out a lot of droppings because the feed that they take are fully consumed, are fully digested, digested. So we are doing the final vaccination for this bat. After this, make sure they don't mix from that side. Eh? John? 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 Give me. One by one, eh? Yes. You know. Now this is the final job that I'm doing for this uh, syringe. So now it is empty, meaning that we've done 20. Even without counting, we have 20 this side, the other one we don't know. That is how you, 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 you count automatically that uh, you know how many birds that you have. And now we are going for another 20. This is a hundred. Eh? Every this bottle has a uh, hundred, uh, hundred ml. We are in problem here. Yeah, this one has. Ah, no, 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 I don't have. So, Nani, pause. Eh? We want to be very sure we've done 20. Eh? So, we are supposed to put down that 20. At the end of the day, we will uh, add all of them. So, we've done 20, we are going to do another 20. We do it very fast. Eh? Okay, fast. And we said it's uh, one ml. One ml per bird.
make sure the one which is not uh, like that uh, sour. Now, when you see, if you can see, make sure that one does not come this side. Yeah? Now we have the water and the feet. Water with the vitamins. Then uh, the feet are there in plenty where they are coming from. There is feet. And where they are coming to, we still have another feet, but they, there is that uh, water with the vitamins. The worker is the vitamin is to make sure is to handle the stress that these uh, birds are going through because of the vaccine. As you know, vaccine is uh, live bacteria that are we are putting to the bird, and uh, for it to settle in the body, it makes the bird feel uh, confused and it is not compatible. So that's why we make sure there are vitamins. This customer is calling us, we are very... So these bats are fully vaccinated. And so fellow farmers, this is how it's done. We are done with the, the two are now empty, meaning that uh, they, they are empty. And the one which is remaining, we had uh, bought excess because we were not sure of how many bats that we have in this farm. So our bats are now fully vaccinated. Now we are through with our today's vaccination. There is something uh, we will be doing next uh, week for this bat. Before we move them to this uh, chamber, we are going to do another video to show you after you do vaccination, after you are through with vac uh, vaccination, what next? That is what is coming up. Uh, make sure you get in touch with us. Keep uh, following us on uh, our channel. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel because uh, this kind of video, you will only see them here at Joke of Cheese Kenya. We are going to separate the, the cocks and the hens. If you want to buy the birds for the layers, if you want to buy the cocks, we'll be having all that. 
So in our, pre, uh, in our next video, we'll be showing you uh, different types of uh, uh, things that you need to do after you are through with your vaccine. Because now what we are just doing is just to prepare them for the market. And that preparation to the market is what is coming up because uh, we will be even showing you how to slaughter packaging. And we'll be one day come here to celebrate the big day. We'll be putting them on the table to cool it and to enjoy.